Hey guys, this is me Amar over here. In this video, I'm gonna show you how can you make your own Arduino based a cell phone. So in this project, we will making a cell phone using Arduino Uno, obviously, and SIM808 module. And with these two module, I will be using a keypad. This keypad will be using for the input purpose. We will give commands by pressing these these buttons and this is actually a very uh, common module that can be purchased easily purchased from the aliexpress with this hardware i will be using a character lcd it's actually 16 by 2 character lcd which can be also purchased from the aliexpress easily so without any further ado let's get into this project Hi guys, uh, let me test this project first. I'm going to turn this project on. The Arduino is reset by the push button. So Arduino is actually collecting the information from the CMA module. So let me make a call first. In order to make a call, press C. And after pressing the C, I will dial the number. And this is the number for the phone that is actually placed on the left side on the screen. It's right on calling. Here you can see that SIM808 calling to my phone. It's actually giving the Arduino giving the command to SIM808 and SIM808 doing a call. Hello. So let me test this. Hello. Hello. So let me test Hello. the speaker of the SIM808 module. I'm actually speaking in Hello. the phone Hello. and this hand free is connected with the SIM808 module. Hello. So let me test the callback function. I'm going to call the SIM808 module. So yeah, you can see that buzzer is working with this Arduino so the both communication is working fine so let's move to the SMS feature of this project I am making a SMS from Arduino and SIM808 module to the other phone first of all I will write the number and then press D after this I will write the text message this is the same text message that is using in Nokia phones the numpad is exactly the same as the Nokia phones so let me write the hello world now I'm ready to send press D for send so yeah it's sending SMS to the phone so yeah you can see that SMS is received from the Arduino let me read this SMS so as you can see that hello world is just received from the Arduino so let me send this hello world again to the Arduino the hello world is sent to the Arduino so as you can see the new message received oh I think I missed so let me send this again hello world to the Arduino SMS sent and yeah you can see that the SMS received press D in order to read this message so yeah it's working it's working fine in order to upload this code 
go to the tools select your Arduino board from board section in my case it's Arduino UNO so I am selecting the Arduino UNO after selecting the board go to the port and select your COM port in my case it's COM3 but in your case it may be different also make sure the liquid crystal I2C library already included in your Arduino ID else your project will not work so after this let's upload this code compiling successfully and it's right now uploading let's upload the code first before do the wiring so in order to do this wiring for this project follow the diagram and things start working perfectly as I showed you in the previous section of the video first of all connect the buzzer to the pin number 12 as you can see over here and ground will be goes to the ground then move to the numpad there are eight pins that is actually connected with the Arduino so connect all the pins from right to left from pin 11 to pin 4 to the Arduino respectively now next move to the LCD let's wire up the I2C based 16 by 2 character LCD with the Arduino UNO VCC pin simply goes to the 5 volt of Arduino UNO ground to ground A4 of Arduino should be connected with the SDA pin A5 should be connected with the SCL pin of character LCD let's move to the same 808 module there are TX, RX, VCC and ground 4 pins actually the RX pin of sim 808 goes to the Arduino pin 2 TX pin will go to the Arduino pin 3 so this is all you need to do but remember always upload the code first and do not plug the USB while connecting the 9 volt DC jack into your Arduino this can be damage your computer USB port
hey guys thank you so much for watching this video so please do subscribe this channel in order to get more updates also hit the bell icon share this video like this video and also uh, stay creative and i will see you in the next one